Nick. Here we go. They're off and running for the Keith Prowse Hospitality Tingle Creek Chase of 2010. I'm so lucky as uh, strode off into a, an early lead then as he comes to the first fence. Put in a short one there, but got over to the other side OK from Putty Robin uh, racing in second place. Third then the red jacket of Govan with Wazo de Nui on the inside as they go quickly to the second fence. Masterminded racing in fifth place. He's running a bit free as I'm so lucky, but he's striding out now by two lengths or so to Putty Robin as they go towards the third with five lengths back to the chasing posse. Summersby on the outside of Masterminded and Govan. Wazo de Nui held up. Kin Keel, Mahogany Blaze. And at the back of the field, held up as usual, Kalahari King. So they're coming towards the fourth now. And it's I'm so lucky. Comes towards it again, jumps it out to the right. And uh, on his inside is Putty Robin, who's settled in second place, carrying his head low. In fourth, third place is Masterminded. He's about seven lengths behind the former dual champion chaser. With on his inside then Govan. Summersby's tracking them with Waza de Nui, Kalahari King and Mahogany Blaze racing alongside each other and at this early stage as you would expect Kim Keel finding it all a bit too much for him. Going down the hill they're going to tackle the water jump next which will be fence at number five and these two leaders have opened up quite a gap now on the chasing pack. I'm so lucky and uh, Putty Robin. There's about a half a length or so between them. Maybe a little bit more than that as they come down towards the water jump. See how they jump it. They jumped it well. Masterminded took it together with Govan in joint third place. Summersby is close up in fifth behind them. Kalahari King has got a little bit closer now. Over the open ditch they go. Putty Robin hit that quite hard. Super leap though by Masterminded. Just watching Kin Keel jumping it now. He's uh, getting tailed off as you would expect. The last fence on the far side of the course. And again, uh, Putty Robin was, didn't get quite high enough there in second place. I'm so lucky then for Puddy Robin. Ten lengths away to Masterminded as they go across towards the top of the hill. Govan is racing alongside the former dual champion chaser. They've taken that fence in great style. Summersby didn't though. He made a mistake there. Wazo de Nui went past him. Kalahari King Mahogany Blaze being driven along furiously and no quarter being given or taken here as they go to the last fence on the far side of the course. Great jump by Putty Robin took over the advantage narrowly from I'm so lucky who comes back at him now on that turn they're heading down the hill with a 10 to 12 length lead over masterminded under Noel Feely patiently ridden up masterminded as they go down towards the fourth last Putty Robin and uh, I'm so lucky who blundered there I'm so lucky masterminded took it in third place Waza de Nui Govan now trying to get going as well masterminded opening up a little bit of ground between himself and the others as he tries to close down these leaders who've got off at a heck of a gallop. They're coming down towards the third last here in the Tingle Creek. Putty Robin again didn't get high at that fence but got to the other side okay from I'm so lucky. Masterminded now is only seven lengths away in third place. A gap then of six more back to Govan and Summersby who's trying to stay on. The others well outpaced and Masterminded makes up the ground very comfortably indeed on that turn. Putty Robin is in front but Masterminded within two lengths now of the leader as they come up towards the second last. I'm so lucky he's run his race back in third. Masterminded drawing alongside Putty Robin, two out, Masterminded, spring heeled at that, he's taken over now from Putty Robin and begins to quicken as he comes down to the final fence, Masterminded up towards it now and he was over in spectacular fashion to a great cheer from the crowd, a wonderful waiting ride here from Noel Feely as Masterminded comes up the hill and he looks to be back to something near his best. It's great to see him back here as he justifies short price favoritism to win another grey one. Masterminded beats Pity Rob Allen to second. Summersby ran on for third and fourth was I'm so lucky just in front of Govan. Sublime Masterminded in a different league to his rivals. A loud Petit Robin who's run a mighty race, masses of rope, ate up the ground and put his rivals away with no mercy. Strode up this Cheltenham Hill that he's come up before to win two Queen Mother Champion chases and a brave man would bet against the third come March. Petit Robin has just held second place from the rallying Summersby who has done really well in adverse circumstances both before and